I had earlier suggested to his honor that uh, the range of sentence was somewhere as low as 21 months and as much as five years. His honor imposed a sentence in that range, so I would say his sentence is certainly in keeping with other cases that have been decided in the past. I wish it had been a lower sentence than that, but that's his honor's decision. Justice Abbey's decision was well reasoned and it was well within um, the law that has been established by the Ontario Court of Appeal. I don't have any argument with Justice Abbey's decision. I nevertheless feel that the sentence was inadequate and that the law, which Justice Abbey is obliged to follow, needs to be changed by the Court of Appeal. I think that the Court of Appeal needs to up the tariff for drunk drivers who choose to go on the road and kill citizens. And uh, that can only be done by the Court of Appeal because every other court in, in Ontario in terms of sentencing is bound by that court. I don't know. I think that the number four is kind of ironic. One year per life and it just doesn't seem like enough. Thank God I have my memories. So I'm trying to just kind of forget about this and, and hope that we don't get, you know, notice of him coming up for parole real soon.